Hello friends, it's been a while since we made videos about docker and containers and I found this cool container that is worth trying and I wanted to share with you how to use it so far uh, it's a docker container about an FTP server based on Alpine uh, we can simply uh, make the container by running this command I have run the command before so let me simply go to it it's the way you see here I change it a little bit I simply uh, got rid of this argument since I do not have a domain name if you do have one for your uh, VPS if you have a VPS or something or you have hooked your computer to the internet and expose it, it and you have a domain name, a domain name or something simply add this thing to it this argument so the command should be something like this there is another modification I have done which I'm gonna show you now which is adding a directory that I believe it should be writable the, the other things no need to change so far if you don't need to like the port the, this one they say here that it is about the I don't know it's about the minimum and maximum part so it's optional also you can simply run the command without it but I'm gonna keep it the way it is before that let's try to run this command without the argument of the directory and see which directory we can write to in our, whenever we wanna exchange files with our FTP server you probably want your FTP server to have a directory where you can write your files to so let's run the command like this we can check if, our, if it is working by running this command and it's working as you can see uh, we go to the files let me go here and then FTP 115 you can know your IP address where you made your IP, uh, FTP server as a docker container by running this command like this and you need to make sure that the port of your FTP server is open if it is the default one it should be 21 I have done this by running the command on this uh, Debian box the command UFW allow 21 like this uh, sorry so like this and then uh, UFW allow 21 uh, mm, USR bin UFW UF Yes, it's S B F W. Yeah, allow 21. I have purposely installed U F W on this Debian box. It didn't have it by default. I don't know for the newer one. This is not a new box. I was uh, testing it, and it was, I guess, it got the support dropped. So I was testing it, and I installed U F W, and this is the command to simplify the opening of the port yeah so it says skip and add an existing rule because I have done this before you can we can see the, the open ports what activate enable yes okay status yeah so it was the the port didn't need to be opened I thought it is opened by running that command and it turns out our firewall is not working and it was I don't know without a firewall maybe so if we go to the IP address which we can know by running the command IPA like this we can connect directly to our FTP server here is a little problem which is we will get the full root file system displayed whereas it's better to have the directory that you choose to be the only one displayed to have it displayed on your system i guess it can be one of these 
for this docker container it's slash ftp slash one probably if we try to paste this file i have selected a file and try to paste it here it's pasteable so the default directory for this ftp server after the creation is slash ftp slash one maybe this one also no it's not Let's go to slash home slash our user and see if it's, no it's not, it's not accessible. Okay, let me exit from the root user, clear out the screen. Uh, leave this, okay. Let's stop the Docker container that we made now, in case you wanna uh, change some configurations in my case I'm gonna change the directory where I wanna write to make it uh, the, the, the home directory for my user which is the user that I'm using is vbox user slash home slash vbox user like this we can change the username Let's change it to Techni, like this, Enter. Okay, Docker PS, it's running the IP address is still like before, not changed 115 this the file that I copied is like this one, copy the username is techni the password is the same, 1234, as you've seen so let's go to slash home slash our username and paste our files here and we can see that it's writable we can create a new document subscribe and it's written to the disk so I was trying to make some encryption to my uh, docker container that will have the FTP server I need to make a first uh, another container for let's encrypt application and there will be the certificate that's going to be made and since I don't have a domain name I cannot do so it needs to be mentioned there that's why I cannot uh, do such thing later after you make such thing unlike me uh, you go and then add some arguments which are uh, this argument I guess you need to have also your address like this you add it here and then this one also it's supposed to be like that if you run this command and it succeeded like this and then this one you add it to your command you have the option to run the command like this or like this it's just a matter of syntax there are various ways to do it i'm sorry for not being able to encrypt my ftp server otherwise if you can simply do it that way okay i guess that's it please uh, subscribe like share and comment thank you for watching and peace